Today, an effort kicked off to restore a place of honor. Recent vandalism has left the Philadelphia Vietnam Veterans Memorial needing some repairs. Marcella Bayetto was there as organizers held a rally to kick off a fundraiser. More than 600 names of those who lost their lives during the war are engraved on the walls of the Philadelphia Vietnam Veterans Memorial. But a closer look at the top of the walls and you'll notice something is missing. People were very upset at the vandalism. About a month ago, those on the memorial's board say about 20 metal fixtures meant to stop skateboarders were pried off from a number of areas throughout the site. They really had to work to get these things off too. There are like 20 or 30 of them that they dug out. That's a lot of energy. Organizers are hoping to raise around $30,000 and that money will specifically go toward fixing the vandalism. They're also hoping to raise another $80,000 for ongoing maintenance and upkeep. One of the main mottos of this memorial is that it is our duty to remember and it is our duty to remember and we reflect that way and keep this place right the way it should be. One of those people working to preserve the grounds is Marine Corps veteran Dennis Best, who was wounded in the Vietnam War when his platoon was hit by an explosive device. There were 23 out of 31 men that were hit, and seven of them were killed, and uh, three of us became amputees, and thank God that things were good. I rehabbed in Philadelphia Naval Hospital. Best says the vandalism disrespects the sacrifices made by those he fought alongside while serving our country. However, with the help of donations, raffles, and the sale of merchandise, the hope is that work can begin soon. We'll go on. And the memorial will be fully restored. In Society Hill, Marcella Bayetto, CBS News, Philadelphia.